What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Emerald walkthrough. Okay, in our last episode, as you probably already noticed, yes, I went through the Sutopolis City Gym in, I think, all ten of its trainers. I could be wrong. I could be exaggerating. I don't know. Draven's been known to do that quite a few times. But we battled a buttload of trainers, and we had to solve these puzzles, you know. Screw up and then, you know, do, do the puzzles. Because, you know, I'm a good guy. I want to, uh, yeah, I want to beat everybody and gain enough experience. But yes, here we are in the Sutopolis City Gym against Juan, the gym leader. Now, if you guys are playing Pokemon Ruby or Zapphire, the gym leader here would be a little bit different. You know, Wallace, that dude that helped us or somewhat helped us or, I don't know, participated in the whole, uh, Rayquaza, Kyogre, Groudon thing. Yeah, that kind of stuff. So. Yes, here it is guys. We're gonna be battling this guy last gym battle of the Pokemon Emerald Emerald thingy right here So here we go Let me ask you did you know ah, I should not be so coy It was I who taught Wallace everything there is to know about Pokemon Once I had given up my position as gym leader in my place. I had entrusted Wallace with the gym However, a compelling reason arose for me to take a, to make a comeback Ah, but enough chatter, let us begin with our match, shall we? Please, you shall you shall bear witness to our art history. A grand illusion of water sculpted by Pokemon. And myself. That kind of stuff. Alright. Bring it on. Let's do this. Alrighty. The battle. The, 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 the sound of war right here going up against this guy. So here it is, guys. Gym Leader Juan. Looking all suave. Looking a silky. I don't know. Whatever. So here he goes. He's coming out with his love disc right here. And now I'm going to be coming out with Shroom Blade because, hey, it's love disc. Look what happened in the last episode. So here we go in the, in, the, in the other screen right here. If you guys are playing Pokemon Ruby or Zapphire, you will be facing Quan. And he pretty much has the same Pokemon, you know, give or take. He does have five Pokemon. He starts off with the love disc at level 40, Celio at level 40. Sea King at level 42, Whiskash at level 42. Be careful for that Pokemon right there because it does have both water and ground capabilities. You know, you gotta get yourself a grass side Pokemon if you do have that. And it's Trump Card. Yes, Milotic at level 43. Remember, guys, some of these Pokemon have water dance or rain dance to power up their water attacks, you know, that kind of stuff. One of these Pokemon is an Ice type Pokemon, so just be aware of that too, you know, Amnesia, all that crud. Now, switching over to Pokemon Emerald right here, we're taking on Juan, this guy right here. Suave, Swoove, Silky, and all that fun stuff. Juan, he does have five Pokemon, pretty much has the same Pokemon as, uh, what's his face? Wallace, yeah. But they're just a little bit stronger, so here we go. Love Disc at level 41, Whiskash at level 41, Celio at level 43, and then you got Crawdont, the water slash dark type Pokemon at level 43, and this guy, Kingdra. Kingdra is a strong Pokemon, a dragon and water type Pokemon. If you guys don't remember, we kind of had our fair share of, uh, yeah, battles with that uh, Kingdra and all that stuff. It does have a Chesto Berry. It does like to uh, do use double team. Be aware of that. Have a dragon type Pokemon to defeat it. I don't know. I don't care. So here we go. Let's do this battle right here. All right. Bring it on, Giga Drain. And, uh, huh. yeah, because I'm slow, Love This gets the first crack at me. Okay, so we're gonna start off. Yeah, we're gonna start off with that. So here we go, Giga Drain. Will it do it? Will it help us out? No. Well, it did. It just, uh, yeah, that kind of stuff. So uh, let's go with the Sky Cut and, uh, yeah, Hyper Potion. You know, the goal here is to use. Or to have, uh, what's his face, uh, Juan use all of his hyper, uh, hyper potions because, yes, this guy, yeah, you know, whatever. Um, let's see, use all of its, all of its, uh, hyper potion just to, uh, you know, not defeat you and all that stuff, if that made any sense. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna switch it to Guy of the Fierce Knight right here because, yeah, Shroom Lee is not doing anything right now. And, uh, okay. Trace the Swift Swim, and I might get a little faster right here. So, the game plan right now is... No! <laughs> Come on! Okay, Calm Mine. Calm... Oh, crud, I should have used Facade. Yeah, that would have worked. Okay, so, uh... Alright, so Calm Mine. Maybe just power it up just a little bit, you know, with a special... 
and all that stuff. So I'm going to try to do it again. All right, go ahead, bring it on. Water poles, I don't care. I'm going to use Calm Mind to, uh, you know, power up my, uh, my attack, my special attack. You know, just to defeat What's-His-Face and maybe make it the Gaia show featuring Gaia, the, you know, Guard Devour or Guard Devour or whatever its name is. Please comment down below. And yes, another one, Calm Mind yet again. That's right. All right, Love Disc. You won't defeat me now. All right. Bring it. Come on. Water poles and I... Come on, please don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Yes, another Calm Mind. Okay, so I'm powering this Pokemon up. Oh, yeah, I'm going to power it up to its uh, complete mug right here. All right. And uh, it's going with another wa or, ooh, water poles. And yes, I snapped out of the confusion. All righty. So that makes it, what, four or five? Maybe I should try it one more time. And then start hitting everybody with a psychic attack. Oh, man. Oh, love this. You are in trouble. You are in trouble, my heart-shaped friend. All right, so let's go ahead and use... Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. X accuracy. Oh, I got like four X accuracies right here. And, uh... Okay, so... <laughs> I think I know what I'm going to do right here. I'm, like, doing... I'm totally doing strategy right in the middle of the, this recording. So, <laughs> this is going to be fun. All right, so it's going with another water pulse. Bring it, just bring it. It's not going to destroy me. So, here we go. Psychic attack. And, of course, Love Dicks. Still faster than me, you know, but, you know. Oh, come on! <laughs> Stop being the... <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> oh, I hate you, Love Disc, you fast, heart-shaped bastard. Okay, so... Okay, we got full heals. All right. Full heals. Became healthy. And that water pulse better not confuse me, because if it does, I swear to God, I'm going to go crazy. All right, so... Yep, you're still faster than me. All right, and uh, here we go with the Psychic. Uh, oh, yes. Bye bye Love Disc. Look at that. Super powerful. That's right. Gaia the Fierce Knight going up against Crawdont. Okay, so now that's the Pokemon that might give me a little trouble because it is a dark type and it will not be affected by, uh, by said moves that I have. So I'm going to go with Facade. And, uh, oh, crud. Ah, crud. Yeah, I should have thought this through right here. So, I'm just gonna keep on hitting it with Facade right there and, uh, hope for the best. Hope for the best! So, there we go. Another Facade. There's that Crab Hammer. Alright, here we go again. Facade. There we go. And, uh, ah, crud. Uh, okay. Facade. Okay, so might not be able to use the next move or I don't know all right facade yet again okay so I defeated crawled out with just a facade look at that oh yes guy of the fierce knight you're kicking some butt right now that's right you're kicking some butt and uh okay so he's coming out with the whiz cash all right okay so let's see I gotta kill my Pokemon real quick because uh chances are this guy might just uh, throw out uh, that Pokemon that we were talking about you know the the one that might give us a little trouble. You know, that Pokemon. And here he comes out with an, am an Amnesia attack. So this will increase its special defense and, uh, yeah. Okay, so well, let's go right ahead and uh, use that Facade attack. Yeah, or not, not Facade, a Psychic attack. Oh, yeah. And yes. Oh, man. It's over. It is over, Juan. It is over, Juanito. So here we go. Raphael getting some uh, points right there. It is over. It's over. Oh, uh, yes. Look at that. See Leo looking like a boss right here. So I'm going to go with another psychic. Just destroy all these buttholes. Look at that. Look at that. See Leo. De free defeated. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Good strategy. Very, very good strategy. So here's the man of the hour that we were, like, kind of fearing now. Now I'm not fearing him. I'm just looking at him. I'm like, oh, yeah, I'm going to destroy you right here. So here we go. Psychic attack and crud. It comes out with the nice beef. Please do not destroy him. Oh, look at that. Look at that. It just took a little bit of damage. So here we go. Psychic attack for the win. Eat it, Kingdra. Eat it. Oh, yeah. Gaia the Fierce Knight for the win. Gaia the Fierce Knight for the win. Look at that. And he's like, 
He's like laughing. He's like, ha 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 ha. Excellent. Very well. You're the, the you're the winner. From you, I sense the brilliant shine of the skill and will of uh, to overcome all. However, compared with me or even Wallace, you are lacking in elegance. What? And screw you. I'm flipping you off right now. Perhaps I. W Perhaps I should make you a loan of my outfit. I would rather be caught dead than to wear your outfit. That's right. <laughs> I merely jest. Rather than my clothes, I shall reward you with this. The rain badge. That's right. That's right. We're getting that rain badge. What now? What now? Finally. Eight badges. Look at that, guys. We got eight badges. Having the rain badge shall ensure you the full obedience of your, all your Pokemon to your every command. The rain badge also allows you the use of waterfall to scale walls of cas cascading waters. And so that, ne that you never forget the battle we shared? Take this, the TM-03. Hmm, the TM-03, what would that be? Huh, oh, technical machine, oh, it's water pulse. Okay, the water pulse attack. In use, it will occasionally confuse the target with the ultrasonic waves. Okay. And we registered this dude. That's good. That's awesome. And uh, the trainers who have all who have gathered all gym badges of the Hoenn region should make their way to the ultimate destination, the Pokemon League. Travel to the easternmost reaches of the Hoenn and the island called Evergrande. There you shall find the Pokemon League, which is true. Okay. All right. I think we've already been there before. Yeah. Alrighty. So. As you can see, we're strutting their stuff. Yeah, that's right, ladies. Eight badges. Who wants a date with the champ in the making? That's right. So, we're getting uh, out of here, and uh, let's talk to this guy. The only man that's ever believed in us right here. He's like, yo, you've beaten, you've beaten even Juan, who was supposedly the best in all of Hoenn. Okay, check your po your trainer card. If you've gotten all eight or all badges, you're set for the Pokemon League challenge. All right, let's see what, what, what this is all about. All right, so look at that, guys. All eight badges. Took us a while, but we got it. So the next destination is the Pokemon League, supposedly. Yeah. All right, so everybody's gone right here. I guess we could take a tour of uh, Sutopla City or... Nah. So in the next episode, guys, I'm thinking... I don't know. I don't know what I'm thinking right now. Maybe another side quest trip. I don't know. Because we kind of we kind of did everything. So I think it's time to go to the Pokemon League, huh? Yeah, I think it's time to go to the Pokemon League. So stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we'll see what happens. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.